Hi everyone, I was asked to show how I do the leveling on the Amiga i3. And uh, so, okay, first of all, we need to go into tools. And then select the level. Right, first of all, you need to tighten up these screws up front and at the back. Not upways, but downwards, if you know what I mean. So this is on the board. Once we've done that, click start. Head will go to position one. And what we need to do now is loosen the screw underneath it until you hear the beep. Tighten it up a little bit so it stops, so that when you just touch it, you can hear the beep. Click next. Take the hot end over to position two. And do the same here. Loosen the screw until you just hear the beep. Tighten it up a little bit. So that when you touch it, you just get the beat. Important part now is to click last. To so take the head back to position one. The alarm is going off, so just tighten it up a little bit more. Until it goes off and you just touch it again. To set it off. Then we click next. Take it back to position two. So now we click next again to position three. Adjust the screw at the back until the alarm goes off. And that you can just touch it and just set it off. Click last to bring it back to position two, and the alarm will go off again. Tighten it up a little bit until it goes again. So when you just touch it, it goes off. Move back to position three. Then take the head to position four. Again, adjust the screw until you get the beat. Tighten it up a little bit, so that when you touch it, it goes off. Go back to position three again by clicking last. Screw up again. So it's off so that when you just touch it slightly, it goes off. Click next. Have a quick check. next then we get taken to the uh, check eye menu screen check no heating it will now go around the board and check If you hear any alarms going off, then you know you need to readjust. Then press check with heating. To 
so it's a little bit of time to heat up. Hot end hot heat up to about 200 C and start doing a test square. If you're happy with the square and it's all stuck down, congrats, you've done. Get the back key, back to leave the menus, and you're ready to print. 